Hey guys, welcome back to Sings Bricks Reviews. Thank you for supporting the channel so far. It's been a really cool last few months, at least making videos for you all and obviously sharing my hobby for Lego, being a adult fan of Lego. It's been awesome. Now, over the next few months, what I'm hoping to do is because we've got the brilliant summer wave happening, I'm hoping to do some live streams on YouTube. If that's something you like, um, hopefully over time it picks up. Live streams, I figured, would be quite cool to do a change of that format on my channel. It's not something I've tried before, but hopefully if all goes well, it picks up. Um, the last few months I've bought quite a lot of sets. I've literally got a huge, a quite, not an overly lot, but I've got quite a bit of a backlog that I'm assuming will last me till end of the year. So I'm hoping to just show you now what's going to be planned in the next few, few months. Saturday 1st of June next week we have the Summer Wave sets releasing. So I'm hoping to buy one for now. I can't buy everything all at once because it is quite a lot to spend on. But it's either going to be the Diagonale set or the Durmstrang ship set. Those are the really cool sets that I have my eyes on. The Great Hall set will be later down the line, but I figured first, let me show you some cool sets. I guess I'll show you now. I have bought the old Dermstrand ship. Still in packaging, but I figured why not? I tend to look on secondhand sites a lot, such as eBay. It's quite cool and you can get a lot of affordable sets and I figured why not it wasn't too bad of a price getting this so it would be nice building this on a live stream this is a 20 over I think a 20 year old set I found about at least 2004 2005 so it's quite cool and so it'd be nice to build this and compare it with the new Demstrand ship looks awesome in my opinion so I'll just put that in there as well as that, we have, actually haven't even opened it. I end up going crazy on eBay a lot and I just buy stuff and it comes through the post and I, sometimes I don't even op um, open it on time. It's quite, yeah, it can be quite a pain as I've got to find space to keep it all. I have a spare room that I do my videos in, as you can see, it's the one now, so I have to always plan my space and how I can lay out my sets. What I'm really thinking of doing is using this space here for a shelf. I have like a shelf that comes just over a meter wide so I can at least lay out future sets that way. Uh, this is awesome. So Diagon Alley. So we have a the old Death Strength set and I had a look at the classic diagonally set so this was one worth getting it's a Borgen and Burks one actually I think it's a Nocturnally set doesn't have a name on the box but this is one of the old ones so it'd be nice doing a comparison with that even though the new diagonally doesn't have a Borgen and Burks set I have another set which actually has that if that makes sense so I thought this would be quite cool this is one of the first ever sets that was released back when Lego was making the Harry Potter lineup. So that's pretty cool. I'm trying to do this all that. I literally have such a big box, as you can see here, full of sets. So let me just show you what is to come. I'll try to do it in order. Here is that one. Uh, ah, here we go. So basically, speaking of diagonally, oh look, there's a spider. That's how long it's been in the box. So, I don't have the box, but I've got the instruction manuals and the pieces. I got the classic diagonally set. I think it was released in 2010. My dates are a bit muddled up, but this was one of the classics that a lot of people loved back in the day. This was so cool and I can see the appeal, just just look at it, how it looks, looks awesome. So I knew I just had to get this for my collection. So we have one generation of a Diagon Alley. 
and we have a second de generation of Diagon Alley here. This was released about 15 years ago. So we've got this one over here. And this set I actually bought back in January. So it's been in a box for so long. I haven't even checked if all the pieces are there. Hopefully it is because I only buy ones that have pretty much everything. Hopefully I haven't been scammed. I'm pretty sure I haven't. It's it's there. Uh, then the next one I figured I'll show you is. So I actually bought this months back as well. This is last year's Diagon Alley set. Weasley's Wizard Weasley's. I haven't even opened the box yet. As you can see, I've just had so many other sets to do. This is worth doing. This is the recent Diagon Alley set. So I definitely have to build this one before I get the new Diagon Alley um, Dionne Vanders set and Madame Malkins. So I have three different Diagon Alley generations to make. I've got the Durmstrang ship here. Uh, what else is upcoming? I've got an old Hungarian horn tail set to do simply because I love this because collecting those minifigures of the fourth movie Tribes of Champions look so awesome and the Hungarian horn tail looks quite cool so I figured why not do that so I've got that to do a minifigure set that's here A old Fantastic Beast set with the Grindelwald. I also have a. But because the new Durmstrang set will come with the Deep Spatting's carriage, I felt I just needed to get the old Deep Spatting's carriage as well. This one's a really cool one because you can it's, it can open up and set up. In a separate way so that's pretty cool so i got that that's part of it as well so quite a few sets in september i'm hoping to get the 2024 advent calendar also i got 2022 and 2023 so that'll be there as well don't know yet what format how i'll be building the advent calendar pieces and then releasing a video but, but i'll think of something that hopefully you guys like but yeah these are my main sets that i'm hoping to do in live streams the diagonally the old um, strength ship so hopefully it's something that you like and yeah i should be doing a live stream hopefully tomorrow um even if you guys miss it hopefully you can just re-watch it when i have it uploaded onto youtube it's something completely new to me, so I need to figure out how it works, get all the sound and everything okay, but I'm hoping to do it around tomorrow, 12 o'clock-ish UK time, DST, really bad with time zones. But yeah, um, hopefully guys, please support the channel over the next few months, I would really appreciate it. If you do want to, let me know if you want me to do the Durmstrang ship first, or the Diagonally set the new ones that are coming out I might get the Dagon Alley one first still thinking about it but yeah I will see you soon so take care